Saturday, January 10th, the BYU women's basketball team put its 10-2 record on the line in their first conference game of the season. They came out strong tonight. The first half, they struggled a little bit. They pick up their 11th win going into next week when they play TCU in New Mexico. Those are going to be big games as well. In the first half, BYU held Colorado State to just 22% shooting. That's really been a staple for them this season. Yeah, their defense is their bread and butter. They were in sync tonight defensively, especially in that second half, forcing 23 turnovers on the night. Kilani Moyaki, Jasmine Foreman, Little Riley, they played well. Bonnie Barbie played well for Colorado State, 14 points for her. Really, BYU did enough to take a 23-20 lead into the half. That was their largest lead of the game at that time. It was a pretty close one at that point, but in the second half, BYU started to blow it open. Shawnee Slade had a career night tonight. She did very well coming out. She was ready to play as well as for BYU. You, you mentioned them. Riley came in, played well. Cassie King did her job defensively. So did Kehlani Moyaki. Big block there by Moyaki. BYU scored 38 points in the second half and shot 46%. Good enough to win 61-43. And our player of the game tonight was Shawnee Slade. Shooting 70% tonight. She was the leading scorer. She did her job on the rebounds defensively. She did it all tonight. Kelly Otteson spoke with her after the game. Great game tonight. And what helped you get into your groove? Um, I just felt really relaxed tonight. I think it helped me kind of calm down and feel confident out there. So I think I was just, just playing kind of relaxed. So. Okay, great. And any expectations for the team the rest of the year? Anything big happening that you're excited about? Um, I think this was a great win for us, especially since it's our first game in conference. And I just think that it's, you know, more good to come. I think we're playing well, and I'm excited for the rest of our season. So, so BYU wins it by 18 and forces Colorado State to shoot just 13 of 50 from the field tonight. Yeah, tonight they did their job defensively. We talked about it all game. This is the key for the coaches for BYU. They want them to step up defensively, forcing those 23 turnovers. They did their job in the paint. They got the ball in the paint to Cassie King and Kilani Moyaki, scoring 18, and they shot the ball much better, especially in that second half. Offensively, BYU's not going to blow you away, but defensively playing great, holding people to about 43 points the last four games. BYU's now 11-2, a nine-game winning streak, and they will take on the TCU Horned Frogs in Fort Worth Tuesday, January 13th.